Yo, man, y'all already know what it is. And if you don't, pause the video right now and smack the shit out of your mom. Then come back to this video and smash that like button. Man, we on a soccer field right now. I'm about to just take me a little walk. Man, this is the closest I'm getting to nature today, man. So, uh, I just wanted to do a quick tutorial on how I was feeling this morning. I felt drowsy as shit. I felt like, uh... I felt like saying no and uh, sleeping in, not looking out for nobody and shit like that. You know me, man. I Sometimes that shit kick in and it make me feel like I don't want to do shit. Like, not going to work feel like the best thing for me right now. Like, you know? So, like, we out here enjoying this beautiful weather. Sun gazing out here. Getting a little darker, you know what I'm saying? Sun gives you energy. And we out here, dog. So, uh... First thing I want to talk about deeply that feelings come and go. You got to learn how to control your feelings and your inner self before you express yourself to other people. A lot of times people are going to be like, this nigga woke up on the wrong side of the bed or this nigga this or that nigga that. I mean, I don't want to be saying nigga and trying to tell you guys about more spirituality things in life. Like, but come on, get your ass some motherfucking sun, dog. You know what I'm saying? It's hot, dog. <laughs> It's hot dog out this bitch. Hot dog, hot dog, hot diggity dog out this bitch. You know what I'm saying? Um, what else? I was meditating yesterday, and I meditated for about probably 35 minutes. Uh, I started thinking about past relationships and all the things that is building me to become this better man and this more spiritual guy, you know? Uh, I don't really have that many friends and the people that i do have sometimes we don't see eye to eye but when we do see eye to eye i feel like we could do many great things man like you know we pushing each other to the limits uh there's no girl i can tell you right now that pushed me to my limits as hard as my niggas been pushing me that is in my circle every girl that i had in my life they always just want attention 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 like Bitch, sometimes you don't gotta be up each other ass. Sometimes it's cool to just, you know what I'm saying, just chill out sometimes. Man, we right here in the shade. Uh, I haven't been out in nature like this in, wow. I mean, I be in nature right by the car and shit. Ooh. So, you know, a lot of times it's like, I don't have time to do this. I have a lot that I have to do. Uh, probably about a month or I'm going to say probably about a couple weeks ago. I wasn't even driving. I'm thankful for that. I manifested driving again and getting in the vehicle. Uh, I was going to bust and all that for like probably almost a half a year or a whole year. My car was down. I broke the accelerator cable. And things from there started looking down, but I had to remember, like, you used to catch the bus before you even had a car. So, like, you have to just be able to deal with this shit. And, you know, um, there's a lot of things that be scaring people out here, but I'm no longer scared of anything. I'm just staying on my grind, man, doing what I do best, man, making my YouTube videos and my rap career. Uh, I just left the studio, what, two days ago, dropped a banger. The bros dropped a fucking banger, a fucking skanger. You know what I'm saying? And um, when me and Mitch finally do drop the tape, we probably gonna fuck the whole universe up. Our energy on the track together is just as crazy as me and Q. You know, so uh, shout out to my man, Bean. You know, he, he dropping some heat on motherfuckers. Like, niggas not even gonna be ready for that shit. But listen, man. I'm just out here enjoying this beautiful ass weather, man. I feel as though if I didn't watch as many astrology videos and keep studying how I am as a person, not just as my zodiac sign, but me as a whole person, as an Aries Cancer dude, you know? Like, it's a lot I have to go through because I can get clingy if I was to get a certain girl. I would want to be around her all the time. I'm telling y'all. You know, and, um,. The best things about life sometimes 
you just got to take the punches and roll. And sometimes after you take them punches, you guys can get up and become a whole new beast. Listen, man. I don't know if I'm holding y'all up and y'all got some other YouTube videos you guys want to watch, but I'll just be trying to talk about more inner self and like understanding myself and understanding somebody else's. Like if I was to put their shoes on and walk in their footsteps. And um, damn, helicopter closest shit over here. You know, and um, hey, shit happened out here, man. Oh, welcome to the Spidey Web. You know? Sungays are rocking the building, man. I was in the shade for a little bit because it was way too hot. But um, I'm feeling them grave, man. Make sure y'all go download that downfall. Make sure y'all stream that shit on all platforms. Y'all see how I'm looking out here all busted and disgusted, man. Still getting that, that glowing, man. I got that fucking glowing, dog. This spiritual journey is not just for me. It's for everybody that I believe in. And I want everybody that I believe in to start meditating. I meditated again last night, and that shit was so amazing. Like, when I went to sleep, it felt like it was actually time to go to sleep. As I was listening to certain things, like, that helped me meditate more, like, and learn how to be able to do it by concentrating on something other than just silence, it be hard because I be ready to fall asleep. Like, that shit be ready to knock my ass the fuck out. I be like, come on, no sleep, no sleep, no sleep. Manifest all of your dreams. Manifest your future. Manifest the things in life that you want to come. You have to actually call the universe and say, hey, I, I think I'm the best rapper alive right now. And I'm just, I, I just need, I just need people to believe in me. I just need people to believe in my YouTube content. I just need the world to believe, the universe to believe that I am already it, you know? I am already that person. I just need people to believe in me. And once people start to believe in me, it's a lot more things I can manifest in my life. I'm manifesting people. I'm manifesting future goals. I'm manifesting a wife. I'm manifesting a woman that can understand the things that I am doing is not just for clout. I'm doing this shit to help me on a journey and I'm recording my whole life like a documentary. When I make it, I promise you people will come back to this video dicky and heavy, but it is what it is. People got, it take other people time to become woke. When my third eye officially opens, you guys will be the first to know, man. I have two subscribers still, and I've been dropping and going hard, but it is what it is, you know? Things happen for a reason, and everything is divine timing. If you enjoyed this video, man, smash that like button, turn that great button blue, subscribe, and comment. You already know, boy. Your boy Rocky in the fucking building. I ain't talking about the bitch, and I'm out.